Good morning, good morning, people. How you doing? This is DC. Welcome to the Intense Fit Way. And it is raining out here again. See the tree down in my neighbor's yard. And it was really like it's gonna come all the way down. Looking for a little bit of push, and it is done. This is next door. This is the front yard. Luckily, the tree went the right way, which is away from the house. What's up, Ray? Reverend, how you doing? It's nice and quiet out here today, of course. Not many cars. The umbrella still has to go in the direction of the rain, or it'll get ripped out of my hands. Whoa. Okay, let me show you this one. Look at the storm drains. They are full. This is the top of the storm drain. See, they got another maybe quick before they start coming overflowing. The water's still flowing today. Everywhere. What's up, cousin? Hello, Diana. Out here in the rain again. It is getting. Well, it's just been raining like this for a day or two. Like I said, all the storm drains are getting full. This one looks like it's about two feet from the top. The water's still running down the streets. I'm interested to see what the lake looks like and um, the stream that's behind the house is over here on Mordred Lane. How's everybody doing out there? You getting everybody safe and dry? Yes, the sidewalks are full of water now. They have their own coat that's flowing downhill. So we are walking around the block. Checking out some trees. Trees look pretty good right now. The road is full of just leaves and stuff at the moment in time. This is where it gets interesting here, right here. This is another water storm drain. And yes, she is getting full. You can hear it and see it. All of them are getting full. I just wore my wet shoes from yesterday because I knew they were going to be wet. Whoa, okay, okay, I gotta go this way. I've already seen that. This looks like. Very interesting this morning. Well, normal and dry in Wyoming. Woo! The wind is blowing here. It looks like I might have to go turn around and go backwards a little bit. Keep it sideways. Look at that. The little baby pool is full out here. Sidewalk to tennis court is wetter than yesterday. Whoa, okay, okay. So now we're about to go to the interesting part right here. This is the lake drain off. Okay, the lake, of course, we see the um, park is full of puddles of water. That is the lake up there. The lake looks nice and high. We're going to the drain off to look first because. We want to see how high it is. But right now, we're right, right below the lake and we see nothing but puddles of water on top of the grass. Whoa, and the drain off is working correctly. What's up, Chris Gordon? How you doing? See all the water coming down the side? We've never seen that before. And then, like I said, we're at the um, tennis court. All this water is just water. All this grass is just water. Puddles and puddles and puddles. Here goes the lake that goes to the Well, this is usually a nice little stream. That was like a big ass lake. I'm over the bridge right now. Don't think the bridge will fly up to go away. But look at all that behind, going behind the houses. This little lake is now huge. It's flowing really well. Hopefully it keeps flowing. You know, today is supposed to be the worst rain day for Charlotte, period. So, all of this is going to go up 
maybe by a quarter, what they say, what is happening right now. So we see the lake is running off right here. What we're gonna do is walk around to the side of the lake and see how, whoa, that's pretty interesting. I've never seen that manhole be that deep. So we got water everywhere. Everything is waterlogged. We're gonna check the lake and then we'll be done for this morning. Just wanna see how interesting it is today. Everything is wet. Trees are still standing, luckily. Most of them I see. I might walk around the neighborhood this morning just to get it in. How's everybody doing out there? I'm sure rain totals are like the pool is to the top, which is interesting. He's never seen a pool to the top before. Or the baby pool. Both of them are to the very, very tippy top. Ready to overflow. I'm gonna check the last thing, which is going to be. Hello, tell me, are you? It's going to be the lake. So we might walk around the neighborhood and see what the trees are like. We might. Woo! I think it's blowing. It looks like that tree is about to fall over on the house. Let's hope it doesn't. There's some shells in the house. Lots of water puddles. So we're walking up from King Arthur right now. You can see all the water it's taking over the sidewalks. All the debris on the ground. Don't see nothing too bad yet, but of course you see the water over there. The lake is coming out of the out of the lake. So everything is just saturated on this side right now. What's up, Billy? How you doing? Derek? Billy, um, I know you know you about that, that tree down in your front yard, brother. Well, at least the branch right now. And the lake is... go towards the wind or it will be ripped out of your hands. So the lake's at the tippy tippy top. I'm trying to show you but I don't want this ripped out of my hands of course. This is Katie Lake. It is full. <clears throat> Neighborhood looks pretty well. Like I said I think I'm gonna go around a short walk just to see what everything looks like out here. We have a tree down in the middle of the lake, interesting, that fell over. If you can see that. I don't know when that happened. It happened yesterday, though, because it was down there when me and Kira walked out here yesterday. Everybody looks like they still have power. Basketball goes down in Kristen's yard. Woo hoo! Man, it's serious. Yeah, like I said, the, the lake has never been in there before. It's pretty interesting. I don't like you have any trees down or structural damage at the moment. Take a shortcut. There are no cars out right now. now I'm going to be soaked. This is the reason why I didn't bring Kira, Kira with me. So this water puddle, puddle right here is going towards into a strong drain. Still, it's all back it up. Uh -oh. So yeah, I gotta use my body to keep this umbrella up. Ah, actually this one is slowing, it's at the bottom. Yeah, it's not full yet. Yeah, this one over here, not full, we're good. Hello, Tisha, what's up, Joe? Let's 
see, we are going. Yeah, you see all this water coming down the street, going through those storm drains right now? See all this water I'm walking in? Yeah, feet are wet. I didn't even put on socks this morning. Just wear tennis shoes that I can walk around in. Woo, so we're going up the street. It looks pretty calm, just nice and wet. See the debris everywhere. In the trees. <clears throat> so it's nice out here today. I think I'll come back out probably this afternoon, do another walk. See what it looks like outside. How much worse it's gotten. Somebody's going out in their car today, so we just cut a tree down over there because it's gonna get in the way sooner or later. Trees down in the neighborhood have been um, happening. I've seen three or four already. Um, I actually saw a few people here yesterday to pick them up. Hold on one second. Oh, just um, out here at the rain, seeing what damage has been done. Did you see the lake? No. Don't look at the lake. <laughs> Have a good day. Drive carefully. One of my neighbors. What's up, brother? How are you? I think we keep her dog. I can't remember the name of it, though. But anyway, we're still out here. <sighs> Walking around the block, checking out the damage. How's everybody doing? What's up, Domo? Woo, that wind is serious. I have, I'm keeping the umbrella attached to my head so it don't fly away. And somebody's house, in front of somebody's house is nothing but a lake of water right in front of the sidewalk. That's why the lady was asking me, what are you doing out here? You know, I me, mean, it's rain. I love rain, I love storms. So, am I driving in this? No, this is not an Uber day, you can forget it. <laughs> Dow is not coming out till Monday. Maybe. We will see. What's up, Brady? How you doing, John, brother? But everything looks halfway decent. I think we got most of the same problems most neighborhoods got right now. You know, Debris and the lakes filling up and storm drains are filling up. Little by little. I mean, even front yards are getting drenched with rain so they're nothing but front yard of water it's like a, a lake in your yard now so coming down here yeah this this sidewalk is um definitely gonna be shaky Whew, but no more trees at the moment let me not speak too soon let me not speak too soon How's everybody doing out there? Everybody staying dry and warm? Yeah, this is interesting. So this storm drain is at the bottom. It's still flowing nice and smoothly. Sidewalks are on this side of the street are just flowing with water. It's packed at the moment. Wow, well, looks like we're coming up on a tree down. Up here, I don't know if this is. Oh. Maybe this is good, but I'm not too sure. We'll see in a second. But it is a rainy, wet day. Stay safe, stay dry. What's up, John? How you doing, brother? Hope you're safe and dry wherever you are. Oh, no, this is just um, trees that they cut down already and put out in the street. So, no, no trees now. Yeah. Like I said, the road, the sides of the roads are full of water. It's going to be interesting if these drains get full. I don't think Charlotte was built for this today. It's kept up so far, so 
You can't talk too much. Man. Yeah. <clears throat> but anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you all well. Stay safe. Stay dry. Um, I think I'll walk down to where I saw this other tree down at my neighbor's house. Then I'll cut it for the day. What are you doing today? What are you watching today? What's up, Tremaine? How you doing, cousin? What you up to, man? Are you safe and dry wherever you are? <clears throat> Nobody's out today. I don't know if anything is open. Actually, I haven't been away from the house except to the convenience store for a day. I might have to take a drive to see what it looks like out here. So yeah, just water on both sides of the street. Sidewalks are full. Looks like people had their basketball goals blew over, of course. Now we look pretty good right now, actually. And, um, with this sustained rain. Now with rain comes other problems. We'll have trees down, power lines. We'll have the roads in the next couple of weeks will be messed up with potholes because of all this rain. So rain always brings its own demons. Guess you could say it that way. All right. So we're going to this one tree that's down in front of Billy Nam's house because we walked around the block. Yeah, so that's the only tree down I see so far. Let's hope it stays that way. at the bottom so it's draining and moving smoothly. And here's our tree that's down. Yep, actually it's just a branch of the tree. But it tore right the hell off. So no problems whatsoever. I said everything is wet. My neighbor leaving. Whoa. I said everything is wet. The storm drains are doing their job. Gotta say those are the ones right in front of my house. I'm nice and full. Alright, so let's call it for the day. We'll see you later. Everybody have a great day. Stay warm, stay dry. This is DC out. Peace.